Hey guys, um, I know it has been a while since I have posted anything, but um, a lot has been going on in the last two weeks that I just needed to do instead of record. Um, one thing was just like one of my friends' family members passed away and I had to be there and I took a break from a recording anything and then um there was this whole there was the George Floyd incident and um coming from a black guy it it cuts pretty deep honestly um and share my perspective of things um Uh, all I can say is, this nation is going downhill. Like, come on. Sitting on the dude's neck until he couldn't breathe. Come on. How many times is this going to happen? Because this has already happened once before, like five years ago. How is it that Like, there is just no sort... Ugh. There is no type of equality here. Like, literally... How is it that anybody who was colored has to experience just unfairness all the time? It is absolutely... The stupidest thing I've ever heard. It, there's just no need for it. But yet it happens every single day. And the thing that annoyed me the most is that. This has been happening for the longest time. And people have just been turned. Like have just been. Like just looking the other direction. While this is going on. And it has been going on for years. I mean Years. And yet now it is just now starting to like uh, be noticeable to uh, to everybody how unfair this world is. Like uh, there's even places up in Africa, across the oceans, where people are speak are speaking out and having protests about this George Floyd incident. What that tells me is that this has been happening, not just here, but literally all over the world. And it's just now starting to come to realization. Come on. There is just no need for that. It's so dumb. You know it's bad when... When I have to literally look over the shoulder when I just have to go take out the trash. Come on. You know, there's something that, um, at school every single day, um, before the school, like, before, like, the school hours start to begin, they say the Pledge of Allegiance. And the part that sticks out the most is when it says liberty and justice for all. No. There is no liberty or justice for all. That only appeals to the white man. It's just not right how we always just get killed over the stupidest of things and then the fact that the person who does it gets away with it and on top of all this people are just not understanding the situation for one thing people now all, like some people think that all cops are bad because of this incident 
for one, that's not the case at all. Okay? Come on. Stop being arrogant. Not all cops are bad. Okay? I know good and well that there are good cops out there. But yet, there, there, there are some who just run like the cops' reputation just through the mud and back. There is just... I've been trying to put off this video for the longest time because um, I don't like to like show that side of me that much because I'm here to spread happiness and try to, you know, um, help people out there. Like, I'm here to, like, I post videos for people's enjoyment. That's, like, this is the whole reason why I started my YouTube channel. I know it's small, but if I can just help one person out, that's great, okay? <laughs> that's great. But I, this situation needs to be taken care of, okay? There's just no reason, like... There's no reason why that a black and a white man or a Mexican and a white man or some other different ethnicity that's not white and a white man cannot just live in a coherent world. So ridiculous. I swear. I've had my fair share of uh, racist people say different things to me throughout the years and I've been told time and time again that this that it will happen that um it will just get worse and I want to believe it will not but it it just does and it's just unfair so unfair we do nothing, and yet we have to deal with this. Man, this is... There has been a time where all this just racism stuff has definitely gotten to me before where people just walk up and ask hey can I call you the n-word what's wrong with my name you guys act like saying my name is such a bad thing and yet you want to call me this this is what I legitimately thought when when I first experienced this and it is just so dumb and always getting called n-word this n-word that and then always having stereotypes about me all because of my skin color. Just accept me for just being Isaiah or Zayblaze. There's you don't need to call me that nonsense. Or you don't need to call anybody that type of racial slur or say any type of racial slur about any type of colored person. I think I'm done. I got everything that I needed to get out. Um, I just needed to come on here and say this because I... I needed to... Like, this is my way of protesting, basically. If you, if you want to put it that way. There's just... It's ridiculous. It just needs to end. That's all. That's... I pray. I pray every single day that it just ends. I'm done. I'm done.